Um, if you're new here, my name is Harmony and I make videos about West Coast living. And as you can imagine, a really big part of West Coast living is, you know, a lot of beach days, a lot of water sports, and for those kind of things, you need to have appropriate swimwear that you feel confident in. So today we're going to talk about the best kind of swimsuits, the best cuts and styles for people with a small chest. So yeah, if you want a little boost of confidence at the beach and you want to like feel like you look proportioned and not like a 12 year old boy like myself, uh, these tips will be helpful for you. And we're also going to cover what styles to avoid because there are certain swimwear where you see it on the model and you're like, yes, that looks good. It's going to look great. But then it comes in the mail and you have a flat chest and it just doesn't look the same. So we're gonna cover some of those. A great example is this one I got from Zaffle recently and it looks absolutely atrocious on me and I do not recommend. So that is not something I'm gonna end up wearing. <laughs> The most important thing to keep in mind is we're trying to find balance between top and bottom. Everybody wants that hourglass figure, but you know, most of us don't have that figure naturally. So we have to find styles that will kind of give us the appearance of more of a hourglass figure. These styles will be a little bit more flattering. Okay, so the first suit that I'm gonna kind of talk about is this one that I'm wearing right now. So as you can see, this sort of cut, this is a, a piece from a brand called Savage, and I got it from Sun Vixen Swimwear. So Sun Vixen is a Canadian boutique and they sell high quality premium bathing suits, but it's basically all that I wear personally. I honestly have probably about 30 bathing suits that either companies have sent me or I've bought or I've kept over time, but I always reach for the same three or four and it's the ones I'm going to show you today. And it's because they have the best fit, they have you know the best material, and they make me feel confident and that's really what it's about, right? So this sort of style works for a small chest for a few reasons. First of all, when we were talking about creating balance between your top and bottom half, rather than this being like a small triangular top, it takes up more space. So this extra kind of band that wraps around your waist is going to create emphasis on the smallest part of your, of your waist and your rib cage. Generally, if you have a small chest, you're not going to gain weight here you'll probably gain it elsewhere. So generally speaking, this is probably a smaller part on your body and you wanna bring emphasis to that. Now let's talk about what kind of styles to avoid before we go on to the next suit. So triangle tops are extremely unflattering on flat chested girls. Um, here are some kind of shots that I found on the internet and when you have a lot of boob that you're working with, this triangle shape completely flattens you out and it doesn't really do much for you in your figure. So by taking a suit like this that's similar to a traditional triangle top, it has a little bit of a different cut to kind of create more curve here. And then by adding on a band underneath, you now have more kind of, of a shape to you, if that makes sense. Um, all right, moving on to another style that doesn't work generally with a small chest um, is a straight cut bandeau. Now this is because if you are really flat chested like myself, a straight cut bandeau is just going to leave you with like nothing and no shape. I've seen some girls really pull them off with a flat chest, but I've always found that it doesn't look flattering. If you're going to go for a bandeau, you're going to want to go for something like this ruffled set that I'll show you right now. Okay, so the next style that I'm going to show you here is the ruffled bandeau. So the idea with this kind of um, style is that the ruffled bandeau adds some volume up top. That'll make your waist look smaller in proportion. So now that you have some volume, it kind of creates the illusion of a little bit more chest and then it just makes kind of everything else, like your waist, seem smaller. And if you're like me, I don't know, when I gain weight personally, it all goes right here. So if you're flat up here, then it just kind of looks like you're a little pear shaped. Um, but yeah, this will definitely help balance that out. Also, it's great for tan lines because if you don't have the straps up here, you don't end up with some like some lines. Finally, what I'll note about this is it's another Pilly Q um, top and it has the matching bottom, which is a cheeky bottom. It's a little bit less cheeky than some of the other ones, which I like because really cheeky kind of makes me uncomfortable. Anyway, moral of the story, if you're looking to create some volume up top, a uh, ruffled bandeau could be a really, really good option. Uh, additionally, if you're looking for a bandeau that's not ruffled, uh, a sweetheart neckline, kind of like the one I'll show here, uh, also a Pilly Q set that you can get on Sun Vixen, is a really great alternative. The sweetheart neckline will create the illusion of kind of like a breast shape, and so I've always found that to be very flattering for flat chest ladies. 
Okay, so this top is more of an athletic kind of cut. So this, this top actually reminds me a lot of a sports bra. And normally, you know, I wouldn't say that this is a good cut for small chests. But actually, if you look at the ratio of like, this kind of top takes up a lot of surface area, which actually creates the appearance of a bigger bust um, in comparison to, you know, the bottom. So there's a nice balanced kind of ratio. Also, compared to some of the other styles that we've looked at, um, this is very minimal for tan lines. So as you can see, a lot of the other cuts came down kind of lower to take up more surface area that way, but this one, it still allows you to get a pretty good tan. Um, and it has these little cute strings, which I really don't know if I'm gonna keep or not. <laughs> I like them and it, like it's cute to have this dangly bit, but at the same time, like they're always kind of, it feels like a mosquito's on you and it like, freaks me out. Regardless, this is a Pilly Q suit and it's really high quality. I end up reaching for this. I've had it for a few weeks now and it's the one that I wanna wear all the time. The bottoms are also cheeky. So in terms of like tanning and tan lines, um, this set is probably like one of the most ideal. The final thing I'd like to note about this cut is that it's also great for athletics. Like if you wanna play volleyball, if you wanna do surfing, stand up paddle board, um, this is, this is, it's somewhat like a crop top, so it's not gonna come off, it's gonna stay in place. And people with small boobs generally don't have to worry about a lot of movement, but still, sometimes if you're wearing like a triangle, like kind of shaped bikini or something, it could slip around if you're doing activities. So this just kind of like leaves you, leaves you secure. Yeah, so here you can see it has some braiding detail on the sides. It has removable padding, so you could actually take this out and order like a high cut and quality padding on Amazon as well and do that. Um, right now, this is the one that it came with for me, but I don't know, I find it very comfortable. It, it's one of my faves. So I definitely recommend this set by Pilly Q from Sun Vixen. They do a really good job of hand selecting all the pieces that they have on there. And they're all really high quality. They're all really top notch brands. And yeah, I just highly recommend. I'm not a fashion expert, but I've just had small boobs my whole life and I've bought a ridiculous amount of swimwear in that time. And so yes, just, Take my word for it on this one. So similar to this kind of top, what you wanna look for is, like we said, kind of maybe a heavier band underneath to create more of like, almost like a crop top feeling. And this one is called, or this, this piece is from a company called Beach Bunny. And I really like it, it's really beautiful. And I often wear this kind of as a top for beach days. So when we have like a beach barbecue or something going on, I'll wear this with jean shorts. Um, because it's a little bit more coverage than a bikini top, but it's a little bit less coverage than a crop top. So this sort of thing is a great option for small chests. The cool thing too, is if you have friends that also have big chests, um, having an extra band of support on the bottom like this one does, it also works for that. So whether you're trying to get more cleavage or you're just trying to you know, create some balance in your body, um, that kind of works. I also really want to know um, if you guys have a flat chest, what have you found works for you? Um, do these tips make sense or is there other styles that I'm missing out on? Um, I also am speaking from a, the perspective of somebody with a pretty small figure, but even in times when I weighed probably like 20, 30 pounds more, these kind of cuts and styles also worked for me then. Um, but yeah, if you're if you're more full figured, what works for you? Um, share in the in the comments below because I want to make sure this is an inclusive guide for everyone. Um, yeah, I have another set that is also from Sun Vixen. All of these pieces are from Sun Vixen, by the way. So if you want, I'll link them below. You can check them out. Um, I've had them for quite some time now, and they've held up immensely. So this next set is a suede number, and it is from a company called. I'll put it right here. And you wouldn't think that suede would be flattering, but this is just a beautiful cut. And I find it works so well on a flat chest because of the embroidered detailing and the little kind of ruffle details. When you have those extra details, they add a little bit more interest to the bathing suit. And that way people aren't kind of looking at your flat chest. It's more a focus on the beautiful cut and hemlines and the embroidery. So I find that's a nice little life hack. Style that's really great for flat chests is a kind of push-up top. So this top actually creates a full illusion that you actually have like boobs going on. Um, it's highly padded, so if you did have a bit, little bit of a bigger chest, like a B cup or something, this will give you nice cleavage. For me, I'm like an A cup, barely, so like it gives me no cleavage. But what's really interesting about this top is I've tried a thousand push-up tops 
in my life in terms of bras, in terms of um, bathing suits and things like that. And what you'll find with this particular suit by sea level, they're an Australian company and Australians know bikinis, um, is that the padding and the fit is just right. So when you bend over, you don't have like gaping empty cups, which is a huge problem for me as somebody with a flat chest and probably you too. Um, so this is actually incredibly comfortable to wear. Like I actually feel like I could wear this and people wouldn't be like, oh, that's fully padded, like it looks fake. This is probably the only suit I've ever come across like this that gives the illusion of realness. Realness. And then the back. I've actually just paired it with these high-waisted bottoms. Alex, when I walked out, he was like, oh, elegant. Um, and these high-waisted bottoms are also from Sun Vixen. They're uh, the Pilly Q brand. And I never thought that I could look good in high-waisted bottoms, but if you're looking for something that's a little bit higher coverage, these are a great option. I, I really like wearing them because like a lot of times, you know, you feel bloated at the beach. So if you're feeling bloated at the beach, it's really nice to have a pair of bottoms like this that you can like kind of wear and not have to worry about as much. So, yeah. I'd also like to mention that the straps on this suit are fully adjustable um, as well as the padding is removable. So if you do want less of a cleavage kind of look, that's an option. Um, for me, it's not an option. <laughs> so I can just leave them in, but yeah, this is the suit up front and I just think it's really gorgeous and it looks classy. Another thing that I'll say about this padded option is that if you're going to like, let's say a Vegas pool bar or cabana or something like that, um, I feel like this is kind of the perfect top to wear. I feel like it can be dressed up with high-waisted shorts, with a high-waisted sarong. Um, this is a very classy kind of option for that sort of environment. So highly recommend this for those kind of events. All right guys, so those are some suits and styles that I like for different reasons. All of them can be found on the Sun Vixen website. Um, I can't recommend this brand enough. You know, they're locally owned, female owned, and managed. If you're looking for high quality pieces that'll last and just make you feel really good, that is my go-to. I have a lot of other bathing suits from places like Zaffle, Cupshe, like all these other brands, but I don't end up wearing them because even though they were cheap, they're just not nice. I don't know, I just don't wear them. So yeah. Like and comment if you had a good time. I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for stopping by and all of the products will be linked below and uh, enjoy the sunshine. I'm actually going to the beach right now. So we'll see you later. Bye guys.